Hi, I'm Philip, and welcome to the first of a series of training videos to help you get started using TrackKit. First, please go to www.track.newbornscreening.on.ca. You can use any supported browser for this, and we suggest that you put this page in your bookmarks. For this demonstration, I will be using Google Chrome as my browser. To log in, you can enter your username and password found on the reference sheet or scan the barcode below them. We recommend you keep a reference sheet near your workstation. When you are logged in, you arrive at the home screen. Scanning your first blood spot collection card will open up a window called the Shipment Wizard. Scan or enter the barcode at the top left of the first blood spot collection card. You may then keep scanning any subsequent cards. Let's see this in action. When you are done, you can enter your email address in the confirmation email field if it is not automatically populated. If your site is eligible for Saturday deliveries or pickup, additional settings will appear at the bottom of the shipment wizard and will automatically be selected for you if the day you are creating the shipment is a Friday or a Saturday. If you create a shipment on a Friday, the box Saturday delivery will be checked by default. If you create a shipment on a Saturday, the box Saturday pickup will be checked. Date and time fields for Saturday pickup will appear, and you will be required to fill them out. Keep in mind, these features only appear on Friday for Saturday deliveries and Saturday for Saturday pickups, only if your site is eligible for this service. If you are not eligible for Saturday shipping or pickup, or are creating a shipment any other day of the week, like we are today, you may leave the rest of the settings as they are, and click Create Shipment at the bottom of the Shipment Wizard like so. Creating the shipment will open up a new tab containing the Pure Later shipping label and automatically download a shipment manifest. You might have to enable pop-ups for the site if the window does not open. We have included instructions on how to do so in your welcome kit. You can now print this label as any other sheet of paper and place it in the plastic pouch on the Pure Later envelope and keep the manifest for your records. If you are using a touchscreen workstation, we encourage you to increase the font size using the buttons on the upper right hand corner of the screen. That's it! To learn about viewing shipments in transit, you can watch the second training video. The link is in the description. 